Charlie McKenna, I'm the chef owner of Lily's Q, um, an LQ chicken shack. The United Center actually purchased a smoker where they use real wood. At Lily's Q at the United Center, we sort of offered our most popular items at uh, the Bucktown location. So we have a pulled pork sandwich. We have a tri-tip sandwich, which is smoked beef. We clean the tri-tip, which is basically about a two and a half pound roast piece of meat. We take all the fat off of it. We're trying to get down to just the nitty gritty of the meat. We rub that with our Q rub and then it smokes for roughly, you know, an hour and a half to two and a half hours. So we hold that, we slice it as paper thin as possible with a knife and then we place it on the brioche bun, which is a nice soft roll, has a little buttery texture to it, really complements the meat. Um, and then the sauces obviously all come on the side, so you can pick your choice of our six you know, house sauces from different regions of the country. Then we also have a walking taco, which is Lily's pimento cheese chips, cheddar cheese, mayonnaise, pimentos, jalapenos. We do whole kettle cooked chips, so they're nice and crunchy, and then we toss them in this pimento cheese powder. Put the pork, the coleslaw in the bag itself, squirt some Carolina sauce on it, which is our tomato vinegar, and then we serve it to the guests in the bag, so it's a lot easier for eating at stadiums and then we have our baby back ribs, which are apple glazed, and you can buy it by the half rack or full rack. Then our sides are coleslaw and potato salad. So some real traditional type barbecue items and a lot of our big sellers from the Bucktown location. At the United Center, we have bone-in fried chicken. We have a three piece, a five piece, and then also a uh, fried chicken sandwich. We do like a traditional Southern fried chicken where it's sort of like your grandmother used to make. We have a brine that we soak the chicken in overnight um, to kind of flavor the inside of the chicken. And then we use a buttermilk and a breading procedure where we have a seasoned flour with different seasoned Seasonings, cayenne, you know, garlic, salt, pepper. We do a typical breading procedure of the chicken with the buttermilk and the seasoned flour, and then we uh, drop it in the fryers and fry it from raw. Lily's Q's at 205, and then LQ Chicken Shack's at 206. They're right next door to each other.